Houston police officer was shot while serving a warrant in the city's third ward. As many of you saw during our 5 o'clock newscast, Houston Police Chief Charles McClellan spoke from the hospital where the officer is being treated. Channel 2's Jennifer Bauer is joining us live from where that shooting happened. And Jen, we understand that you now know the identity of the officer. We do, and he has been with HPD for the last seven years. We are getting some information from the police chief a little earlier. You know, here at the scene, I can tell you that officers are just about wrapping up their investigation, but that does not mean this investigation is over. In fact, the search continues tonight for the person who shot that police officer. Now, earlier today, it happened right here in the 3000 block of Anita. Two officers were serving a narcotics warrant. In fact, they had even taken two people into custody when the officers heard a gunshot. 45 year old Kenneth Frije, who has been with HPD, as I mentioned, for seven years, was shot in the back of the leg. Now, earlier today, we did have a chance to hear from Police Chief Charles McClelland. Police officers on the scene heard a sound which they identified as a gunshot. And Officer Frije later determined, and it was discovered, that he had been shot one time. In the rear right leg. Next thing I know, the officers say, get down, get down, get down. Then they said somebody was shooting. And I just know the officer told me to get back, and I took off running behind someone's house. Because the guy was shooting. Yeah, and the officer got shot. Now, it's unclear at this point where that shot came from. Some witnesses apparently told investigators that they saw the shot come from a car that was driving by in this area. Other people are saying that it may have come from one of the buildings here or one of the homes here on this street. So at this point, it does remain unclear. I can tell you that the officer who we are talking about has been released from the hospital. We are told he is going to be okay, but he does still have some bullet fragments in the back of his thigh that are going to need some treatment later. Possibly surgery. As I mentioned, this case does remain under investigation. It's unclear at this point if the officer is targeted. We are live in the third ward. I'm Jennifer Bauer, KPRC, Channel 2 News.